Broadsword calling Danny Boy. Okay, YouTubers, this is Joe from Artanian TV, another game of interplanetary ice spy going on here. Now, this is the Indian Space Research Organization's website here, as you can see at the top. And something a bit odd going on here. Uh, I think Chris over at Mars Anomalies pointed out one or two oddities in these pictures already. And I've already, I think I was the first to publish a UFO from any of these images uh, on YouTube, so that was funny. Uh, and some structures, of course, uh, huge rectangular structures on the surface. Um, I've already covered those in previous videos, so you may want to check out this one. Mars, India's Mangalyan Satellite Spots Massive Saucer UFO. And there's another one here, Mars, India's Mangalyan Spots Blue UFO, Long Strip and Large Alien Buildings. Check those out if you want to have a look at them. Uh, we'll keep this real quick. Now, I downloaded these straight away as soon as they came out last week and uh, well, I thought yeah cool yeah some nice pictures there but there don't seem to be very many I mean they've been out there a while now and there's only like three images from Mars and one one taken from above Earth so what are they doing you know and there are some inconsistent quite obvious inconsistencies with, with uh, these images and I will show you what I mean now now this is the the main one of the Mars surface here, an angle. Now, I didn't notice this at first. In fact, I made the first video and I didn't really check. And it was when I was making the, the new video about um, the Indian satellite uh, just the other day that I started zooming in and had a, having a real close look. Now, this is fake. Uh, I'm not saying all of this is fake but at least half of this image is fake. This black area here, the so-called space, or whatever you want to call it, um, is completely fake. And when you zoom in, as I will show you, these stars have all been put in digitally. Uh, it looks like it's been very poorly done on a black background. Someone's just got a black background, and they've made some cross shapes, little blue cross shapes. There's one. You see that? I can't zoom any further. And they're all exactly the same. There's another one here, bright blue, another one there. And some of them are small, one single pixel dots here, which are sort of yellow. Okay. But all the others are blue crosses, and they're identical. All of them are identical. Now, if this was a star map, there would at least be clusters and there would be uh, different shaped stars and they wouldn't all be uniform like this. This is a complete utter lie. This whole so-called space background here is, is is manufactured. The whole thing is completely serious. They're all the same. I advise you to go on their website and download the image and just you don't have to do anything to the image you don't have to enhance it or anything. Just look at it. Just zoom into it. That's all you got to do. It's a joke. Uh, <laughs> I, I was, this really, really annoyed me. Um, what, what the hell are they doing? Is, is this an indication of them obfuscating and, and manufacturing images or doing what NASA have done for many, many years? I think it is. And uh, I'm really quite annoyed about this. And, I, and I'm, I, I, I ask all my new subscribers out there who've just joined from India and other parts of Asia, I ask you to all download this image and all have a good look at it because it's pretty obvious when you get in close that all these stars are completely artificial. They're not they're not stars at all. These are these are done on a computer. Somebody has made about two or three different stars. They've made a blue one like this. Then they've done a single dot pixel one like this one here in yellow. Okay? And there's another slightly different one here, like a little orange one there. They've done three different types of star, and all they've done is copied and pasted them over the background, over a black backdrop. This is a complete lie. The whole. Th <laughs> so if that's a lie, then we, what's this here? Is this a lie? Um, <laughs> I flipped it round. 
change the color. I did a, a one step photo fix there, I think. Yeah, photo fix, it says at the top, goes blue. Then I changed the color balance a little bit and, and then brought the color, I mean the, the brightness right down. I just darkened it right up. That looks more like Mars. And we know what Mars looks like from, from the Hubble images. It's a lot bluer than we're told. It has an atmosphere. Okay, it's not supposed to be a very thick atmosphere, but do we really know? I don't know if we're being told the truth. I mean, if they're lying about these backgrounds, I mean, look at all these fake stars here. I mean, this ridiculous one, two, three, four, five. There, there's loads of them. They've just copied and pasted them. They've done a few and then copied them all and, and pasted them all over the, back, the black backdrop. I mean, what the hell are they doing? This is ridiculous. Uh, uh, this really annoyed me. I really thought that for once that uh, we get a bit closer to the truth with this new satellite up there and get raw image data sent straight down so that everyone around the world can download it. But we're not. We're, we're getting obfuscated and altered photographs. And that's pretty obvious. Let's have a quick look at this one here as well. I wonder if that one's got... Uh, da, da, da. Hang on a minute. Oh, here we are. I've got it here. Let's have a look at this one. Let's see, if, let's see if the stars are the same on this one, if there are any. And it's, it's, this looks a little bit more natural. There's one there. And there's lots of sort of... Uh, see, uh, I don't know. Yeah, that looks more natural. You, you've got a lot of distortion here from where you've got sort of light reflecting off the planet, I suppose. And there's sort of lots of little lines and crap in here. But you've got to ask some questions about some of these. I mean, maybe that's just the way the camera interprets the uh, points of light in 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 the uh, in space. I keep wanting to say in the sky, but it's not sky, is it? It's space. But yeah, they do seem a bit uniform. Some of these. I mean, these little crosses. So I'm not too sure about this one either. Um, I mean, this is the thing that everyone's talking about now. Is this this thing here? And. Uh, you know, some some of my subscribers have already said it looks like a bit like a more like a building, or yeah, it could be a UFO, it could be. I think it's a bit like the Black Saucer Citadel structure that I previously published a while back, uh, months ago. Uh, it could be a massive, massive saucer type structure that's landed or just taking off or about to land. And there's loads of little rectangular structures in here as well, um, loads of them. When you're getting close, and you know, check my previous videos for that. I probably will do an update on some of this and get in really close and see what can be found because this is quite a cool image, even if the stars ain't particularly real. Um, it's not a bad image at all, and it's in quite good resolution. Unfortunately, we're not getting the TIFF files from the Indian website, so I don't know what's going on there. We're only getting JPEGs at the moment, which I think is a bit amateurish. Um, but we shall see. It's early days. They are probably still running tests and that kind of thing. So I'm not going to write them off just yet. But it does really annoy me when this happens. You, you expect a new country to come along and, and give you at least some sort of idea of the truth. And, and it just goes to show that they're all in it together, these people. And uh, other people have said this recently. And these, these stars are fake. Look at them. <laughs> that is being copied and pasted onto there and then pasted and pasted and pasted. This is nonsense, this whole picture. Absolute nonsense. What the hell are they trying to pull? Do they think we're stupid? Honestly, I'm really quite annoyed about this. And I, I just wanted to show you, uh, this is just for a bit of a laugh, just to lighten the mood slightly. <laughs> my previous video, I, 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 one of my previous videos, I published this guy in the middle here, which looks like a... Um, a kind of pharaoh king uh, on the surface of Mars, a little statuette. It's very small. It's only like two or three inches tall, this thing. Really small. The rest of it's probably buried. And here's an Egyptian king here on the right. Uh, but I thought the, the guy in the middle looked a bit like Ed Miliband, our, our infamous Labour leader in the UK. <laughs> I just thought I'd throw that in. <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> what, what can I say? I only did that for a laugh. I just thought I'd try and lighten the mood a little bit. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'll see you soon.